Hey y'all, I just got the manual follow focus from Tilta, the smaller ones. Um, and I wanted to compare the two because when I looked online, I actually couldn't tell exactly um, what the difference was. I, I saw a lot of YouTubers um, talk about the Tilta mini follow focus. Um, so I got that one first, but I got really annoyed by um, the hard stops, not being able to stop or, or come off essentially so you could spin the thing infinitely. And so they would make all this noise. That, um, so you would get the noise from the follow focus ring and then you also get the noise from these little metal pieces just falling as you rotate it. And that got really frustrating. So I picked up the Tilta Pocket. Tilta has a video where they talk about the Pocket, but what I think um, they don't show is like both of them side by side. So they talk about the new features, but you can't really see exactly what the difference is. Um, so we're gonna go over some of those differences um, and why I definitely uh, like the Pocket better. I think that you get more space inside of the Pocket's case um, rather than the Mini. The Mini's case is smaller, but where I think that it fails is like sometimes you're closing the lid and it'll get like squished and you have to really force it down unless you place everything perfectly. Whereas the pocket, it seems to f um, be easier to set in or like reset for its safety case. The main reason why I like this is the infinite spin. So um, the, what the pocket did differently was in st rather than having, um, uh, when you loosen these tightening knobs, um, and having them spin, you just keep them tight wherever you want them. Um, and you can uh, adjust the hard stop. So what that looks like is, is if you want the follow focus to have hard stops rather than infinitely spin, is you just flick this one switch forward and now all of a sudden you have your hard stops again. Um, I found that to be incredibly helpful. Um, a bunch of the other differences that are um, small um, are there's some like different writing and stuff. So like the lock switch, um, the, the tilt of branding and some of the color differences. So like the pocket has these red little tabs, um, but everything else feels pretty same. They, they have a physical switch that lets you bend the focus to and from your lens. Um, the other thing is that, uh, the, you know, they have the same lock um, for the your 15 millimeter rail, wherever you decide to put that. I think technically Tilta says this is lighter. I can't really feel a difference um, physically, but I'm sure that it is. Um, you can still swap your gear piece to the other side if you need to get it, you know, closer or just have um, two different uh, gears. The These focus rings both have a really sim. I think this white piece right here, I think this white piece right here is technically bigger. Um, then the minis, um, I think that's one thing that they updated. Both the white pieces are still magnetized, so you get this like soft click once you have them in place. So it's 10 bucks cheaper than the mini. Um, this one just feels better, but um, maybe if you guys know of any reasons why the mini is preferable, um, this one still seems you know relatively the same size and has some of those new updated features, but yeah, let me know. Thanks you all for watching and I'll see you in the next one.